as a writer, Nas has personified all of these objects in songs, except for one of them. Is it money, a prison cell, a gun, or a pen? Jesus Christ. Okay, let's work backwards. Okay, so a gun, I know it was I gave you power. Mm. So I know that's out. Money? Didn't he have a song called Money Is My Bitch or something? Like, wasn't it one of them fucking really bad songs? Like, Money Is My Bitch or... And let me be clear. I mean, Nas is one of my... I love Nas. You know what I mean? But um, after it was written, it was kind of, you know, it's kind of touch and go. But um, but as a lyricist, I mean, you know, as he's, he's, you know, he's incredible. I feel like there was a really bad Money Is My Bitch song. But, but I don't know. But if Money Is My Bitch... Is, well, yeah, that's personification because you're giving a human quality to something that's not human. So, yeah, put, turn my English major brain on. A prison cell. Did Nas rap as a prison cell? I don't know. I think he rapped about, you know, being in a I opened every cell in Attica, sent him to Africa. Mm. That was our route of the world. But but he wasn't. He was just talking about that. I always thought that was an inaccurate line because I know Africans would not feel that. It's like if you was open every cell in Attica, send them to Africa. No, you will not, nigga. No, you will not. No, you do not want the prisoners here. No, no. Like they, they are not trying to. Africans do not want our fucking prisoners. They're like, can we talk about this first? Can we, can we maybe just uh, before, before we uh, open the floodgates? Maybe you could ask Africa. Right. Yeah. Like I mean, can we have some African dialogue about you know where we gonna send all these convicted felons? But okay, so I don't know prison cell. I don't know a pen. Nas writing as a pen, personifying a pen. I don't know. Like I, that seems a little too on point. I, I, I'm gonna go with. I'm gonna go with a pen. We're gonna take a journey right now. First, you nailed it. Yep, there was. It's like I'm a motherfucking gun. I can't believe this yeah. shit. Wait, I always sort of had a problem with this song. <laughs> like I appreciate the concept of it, but it's one of those things where you're supposed to show and not tell. Like just right. Rap Gun. We got it, dog. Like, we can figure it out. Figure it out. Like it's like I'm a gun. It's like I'm about to re record. It's like I'm about to rap a song from the person about being a gun. <laughs> <laughs> Get it, Nas. You were correct about your second one. Money, my bitches, my money. I knew that was the thing. I remember that fucking song. You can't be faulted for trying to erase that, maybe from your memory. Here's the moment <laughs> of truth. I'm a prison cell, six by nine. He did rap hey! about that. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We had, you know, we had to raise the bar up a little bit for somebody of your I, stature. I, I, listen, man, I appreciate the challenge. The one thing I've learned just from doing QLS is that we all have our blind spots. Someone can be an expert in jazz, but in Migos, they don't know shit. You know what I mean? So it's, it's all, I'm up for the challenge. <laughs> 